Hey guys, it's Angel. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. And today, we na naman tayong bagong ukulele tutorial. At ang tuturo ko sa inyo is another song from Ben and Ben's latest single. And this is a perfect song para sa mga tot ganin yung or yung mga tinatawag na the one that got away. So ang title nito ay sa susunod na habang buhay. But before we start with our tutorial for today, if you're new here and if you want to learn how to play the ukulele, don't forget to click the subscribe button down below and the bell notification button so you'll be notified every time I upload a new video and also mag-subscribe na rin kayo sa vlogging channel ko I upload uh, yung mga travel vlogs at kung mga ano-anong video pa doon and also nag-announce din ako doon ng mga giveaway so kung gusto nyo sumali, just subscribe to that channel pero syempre, wala muna tayong giveaway ngayon dahil lugi ang kabuhayan dahil sa COVID-19 and magpa-shoutout din muna tayo shoutout to Irish Saison, Saison, Irish Saison, yan. Kay Fabi, kay Avocado, ni Jager, kay John Ray Reyes, G Agapay, Don Maala, Ukulele Darling, Lorraine De Chino, Lucy May Castañas, and kay Lord Don Siki Sato. Hello sa inyo lahat. Thank you so much for watching sa mga videos ko. And sana magustuhan niyo yung bagong ukulele tutorial natin today. So without further ado, let's get started. So, let's start with the chords na kailangan natin matutunan and there are six. Tapos, isa lang dito yung bar chord, D minor lang. So, let's start with a G major. Index and middle finger on the second fret first and second string. Tapos, yung ring finger ninyo dito sa may second string, third fret naman. Next is D major. So, lahat nasa second fret and then yung index, middle, and ring finger ninyo nasa fourth. 3rd and 2nd string. Yan. Next is E minor. Index, middle, and the ring finger. Index on the 1st string, 2nd fret. Middle on the 2nd string, 3rd fret. And then ring finger sa may 3rd string, 4th fret. So that's E minor. Next is B minor naman. So you're just going to bar your index finger dito sa may 2nd fret. And then, yung ring finger sa may 4th string, 4th fret. So, that's pangit. So, that's B minor. Yan. Next is F sharp minor naman. Index sa may 1st fret, 3rd string. And then, middle and the ring finger sa may 2nd fret, 2nd and 4th string. So, yan yung F sharp minor. And for our last chord, A major. Parang may similarities lang siya sa F sharp minor. Tatanggalin nyo lang yung ring finger ninyo. And that's A major. So, index sa my 3rd string, 1st fret, and then middle finger sa my 4th fret, 2nd string. So, that's A major. So, those are the chords. And now, let's proceed with the intro, verse, and pre-chorus. Pagkasama-samayin ko na yung tatlong parts na yan kasi magkakapareho lang sila ng strumming pattern. Although, dun sa pre-chorus, yun yung iba yung chord progression. Pero, madali lang naman. So, sa intro and verse, ang chord progression lang is G, D, E minor, and then D. Sa intro, you're going to repeat it twice. Sa verse, twice din. <laughs> Kasi sa verse 2 naman, isang beses lang yun. And then, sa pre-chorus naman, ang chord progression is tatlong G lang. So, makikita nyo dito sa visual aid kung kailan kayo lilipat ng chords kung sa ang word na. And the strumming pattern that we're going to use para sa tatlong parts na yan is puro down strums lang. Pero hindi siya basta-bastang down strum. Kailangan sabihin nyo yung rhythm at yung beat nung kanta. So, medyo pakinggan nyo yung ano eh, pakinggan nyo yung original song para magka-idea kayo kung kailan yung tamang pag-switch. Strumming pattern yung turo ko sa inyo, bali ganito siya. Down, 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 down. Bale, limang down yun. Kada chord. So, G. Ganito. Sa G muna tayo. Down, 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 down. Down, 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 down. Down, 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 down. Down, 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 down. And then, ulit-ulit lang yun para sa intro, verse, at refrain, or pre-chorus pala. And then, sa pre-chorus, ganun din. Ganun lang yung 
scrumming pattern. Kung gusto nyo gumamit ng iba pang scrumming pattern, pwede din. As long as nasusunod nyo yung chord progression, okay lang yan. So, ganun yung chord progression, ganun yung flow ng strumming pattern para sa verse. And now, let's try to play the intro, verse, and pre-chorus naman ang magkakasama. chorus and now let's proceed with the chorus part naman. So yung buong song meron siyang tatlong chorus. Unahin muna natin yung chorus 1. So para sa chorus 1, ang gagamitin nating strumming pattern is single down strum lang per chord. Ganun ganun lang siya. Sobrang dali lang. So ganito yung chorus 1 using single strum. Hindi pa pangako mo So, ganun yung strong pattern para sa chorus 1. So, pag na-reach ninyo yung E minor hanggang sa mga susunod na chords dun sa E minor, ang gagawin ninyo is puro down strums. And then, you just have to repeat the intro, tapos second verse, second pre-chorus, and then second chorus naman. So, dito sa second chorus, iba na yung strumming pattern natin. So, ang gagamitin nating strumming pattern for the second chorus Sa third chorus, ito din yung gagawin ninyo. So, ang strumming pattern is down, down, up, up, down, down, up, down, up. Again, down, down, up, up, down, down, up, down, up. Slowly, down, down, up, up, down, down, up, down, up. Down, down, up, up, down, down, up, down, up. up. So, yun yung gagamitin ninyo strumming pattern for chorus 2 and chorus 3. Pero ganito siya. Mula dun sa D, F sharp minor, B minor, and then G, yung strumming pattern, uulitin nyo siya ng dalawang beses before kayo lumipat ng next chord. And then, pag na-reach nyo na E minor and then B minor, dun ulit start yung down, 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 down. So, ganito naman yung flow ng chord progression and strumming pattern para sa chorus 2 and chorus 3. So, diba, two times na strumming pattern before mag-switch ng chords para dun sa D, F sharp minor, B minor, and then G. So, ganito siya. Let's start with a D major chord. So, down, down, up, up, down, down, up, down, up, sa pa. F sharp minor, one. instrumental part, play muna natin siya with the lyrics naman. Hindi pa
para sa chorus 3 or yung final chorus. Ang pinagkaiba lang niya doon sa final chorus is yung lyrics. Pero yung chord progression and strum pattern, same pa din. And now, let's proceed with the instrumental part naman. So, para sa instrumental, ang chord progression is D, F sharp minor, B minor, A, F sharp minor, and then G. So, andito yung chords ng instrumental part. And the strumming pattern that we're going to use para sa instrumental part is yung down, down, up, up, down, down, up, down, up, pa din. And para sa D and F sharp minor chords, ang strumming pattern is suulitin niyo ulit ng dalawang beses before kayo mag-switch. Para naman doon sa mga remaining chords mula doon sa B minor, A, F sharp minor, and then G, one round na lang ng strumming pattern, and then lilipat na kayo. So, ganito yung um, flow ng chord progression and strumming pattern for the instrumental part. instrumental part and then afternoon is yung final chorus naman. So for the final chorus, ang chord progression is G, F sharp minor, B minor, G, E minor, and then A. Tapos D, F sharp minor, B minor, G, E minor, B minor, F sharp minor, and then G. Dito sa part na to ng last chorus, mix naman siya ng strumming pattern. So, para sa first part ng final chorus, ang strumming pattern niya is single down strum long per chord. Pero, gaya ng mga naunang chorus, pagdating dun sa E minor, tsaka kayo magda-down, down, 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 down ulit. And then, dun naman sa second part ng final chorus, dun yung nagagawin yung down, down, up, up, down, down, up, down, up, yung strumming pattern. So, ganito yung flow ng chord progression and strumming pattern para sa final chorus. And then, F sharp minor, B minor, and then G, tapos E minor, down strum, start ng down strum, and then A. And then, second part, gawin nyo na yung ginawa ninyo sa second chorus. Down, down, up, up, down, progression and strumming pattern para sa final chorus. So basically parang pagsasamahin nyo lang yung chorus 1 and chorus 2 dito sa chorus 3. Kung ano yung ginawa ninyo sa chorus 1, yun yung para sa part 1 ng final chorus. And then kung ano yung ginawa ninyo sa chorus 2, yun naman yung para sa part 2 ng final chorus. So ngayon, let's try to play it naman with the lyrics. Hindi pa pangako mo nung Chorus and then afternoon yung outro naman. So, ito yung outro. Hindi ko na siya ipiplay. 
Kasi single down strong lang din naman siya. So, ito yung cords at nasa description box din yung PDF file para sa buong song. And that's it for today's ukulele tutorial. I hope you enjoyed it. Give it a thumbs up if you did. Share niyo sa mga friends niyo na fan ng Ben and Ben. At gusto rin matutunan yung susunod na habang buhay. And of course, kung hindi pa kayo nakasubscribe, please do subscribe to my YouTube channels. Follow me on my social media accounts. And I'll see you on my next video. Bye!